Hello and welcome, 13th of January, it's about midday, sunny's out, beautiful sunny day, but it's still January, so it's still cold. Let's have an update. Right, let's start with the onions and I planted these onion sets middle of November and they are starting to come up. Got some nice onions there. To tie my broad beans up to the stakes, getting a bit tall and on a windy day they're blowing about a bit. We've got empty bed there. I don't normally don't at all cover my bed with plastic or anything but no weeds there so all good with a mostly empty bed but at the back here we do have these mystery plants which I've spotted for a while but I grew interest in them just the other week when I was like what are they let's have a look take note there's kind of a vertical stem with leaves coming off the side Keep that in your mind, keep that in your mind. There's a leak. There's a leak. Vertical with leaves coming off the side. Could these be leaks? If so, how on earth did they get here? Well, the only thing I can think of is... Last year I had leaks here which I harvested in March, but I did leave a couple of plants towards the back down there left to go to flower and produce some seed which I've collected and is in the shed slash greenhouse. Could it be that a few seeds fell off and developed into leek plants? It would have been pretty late in the year for them to be sown. That may be a reason why they're so small. The leeks flowers, produce seeds, can must be July, August time, so somehow they've survived and are growing. That is my assessment at the minute, we'll find out when I dig them up. Um, let them get a bit bigger first. Right, another empty bed. Get the fruit zone. And we've got another camera here, this is a wildlife camera. I did a video about a month back with a time-lapse camera that took a video every five seconds. Just see what happens when I'm not here. It didn't have a, like, a trigger if anything happened. It just took a picture every five minutes, standard. I did capture a picture of a pigeon though. Uh, this one I got asked to try out uh, by other people at the allotment. Because um, I'd seen I'd tried out my time-lapse. So I'm just testing this for wildlife because it, it's got a sensor that something walks across it, it takes a picture. I've got a picture of half a fox so far, uh, still testing it, uh, we'll see how that goes. Raspberries, be cutting them down soon, I'll be pruning the pear and apple tree soon. Oh, at the back, at the back I have come into some double glazed pens there. Okay, watch this space. Let building commence. Let building commence. Into the shed slash greenhouse. We've got my garlic popping up nicely out the soil. That'll go outside soon. <sighs> Peppers. Obviously, cut my losses. They're not going to go red. So. Took them off the plant, cut all the leaves back, hopefully that plant will survive. I have been sowing, I couldn't help myself. Some sweet peas and some coriander. You never know, you never know. Let me just pop the camera here. Right, got my camera set up for the wrapping up. Sun, I don't know if you can, it might be in shade, might be in sun, who knows. Oh, I was down here at the weekend for a couple of hours, but I was having so much fun. <laughs> I didn't I didn't I didn't make a video. 
I was just pottering around doing it, just tidying a few things up, moving bits of wood around. The, the highlight was maybe finding a piece of wood that exactly fit a little gap I've got in my shed slash greenhouse. Just filled that. It was a joyous moment. Oh, I, I, just, I just enjoyed it. You know what I mean? The weather was like this. It was nice. Just pottering around. It takes your mind away from the stresses of life. Pottering. Oh, it was brilliant, pottery. And, oh, I've been keeping a track of what I've been doing last year. I was um, not very planned out. I had too many seeds. Well, I wasn't planned out at all. So I'm writing everything down in here about what what, what I plant when and where. And, and I'm also keeping a track of my time. And pottering is one of the main activities at the minute. Oh, a sign of how disorganised I am. So I collected these seeds last year. A little makeshift envelope, <laughs> some curled up bits of paper, another one there. Seeds in it. I didn't write what they were. I've written on them since. Flowers. 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 Cornflower question mark. Need to get more organised. That kind of sums it up does. I'll plant them. See what happens. There might even be leaks. <laughs> Who knows? Who knows? Oh, so it's all, it's just nice, isn't it? I mean, this is like lunchtime on a work day. I've, I've, I've been trapped inside for a couple of days. Not trapped, I, mean, I could, could have got out, but I didn't. It's just nice to get out in the sun sometimes. Just enjoy fresh air, time here, mind, taken away from the stresses of everyday life. Move some bits of wood around. Nice one. Right, thank you for watching. Click subscribe. Send me a comment. I'll see you next time. Cheers.